Okay, hey guys, Scott again. In this next video, we're going to talk a little bit about the custom menu that you see at the top here, how to modify that. And to do that, I'm going to go back to the admin section and I'm going to look over here under appearance and then you see this menus tab. Just click that and that will take you to the menus manager. So you can see that the pages that are represented at the top of the template are here and I can change the title of any of these here. I can also remove the menu here or something really cool uh, that WordPress custom menus allows you to do is I can drag and drop these menus in relation to one another. So let's say that I want to maybe move about us under contact us. You see that I can just move it, drag it I can also reorder if I want privacy policy to be above earnings disclaimer for example I can just reorder that and then just click save and now when I go back to the site it's automatically created a flyout for me and it's changed the order of those menus so just that simple in a few seconds uh, I have changed my menus and created flyouts but I don't uh, I'm not limited to that I can actually create custom links and add them to the menu so I could link to any page within my site or any external page. Uh, I'm just going to collapse this so you can see a little bit better. Uh, I can see all of my pages and right now they're all they're already in the menu but if I had additional pages I could easily just click one and click add to menu and it would show up there. Uh, I can even put categories into this menu. I don't have any categories on this site but if I had categories I can just click view all and I can see the categories. You can see that only the um, click bump default layout categories are shown here. Um, but once I add categories to the site, I can easily add them to this menu just by selecting one and clicking Add to Menu. And you can see it shows up here again. This is one of the layout categories. You don't want to add that one. But you can see how simple it is to add a category and then you can move it anywhere within the current menu that you like. Okay, so I, I would just go here and click remove and that's done and I can just click save menu and you can see that that's WordPress custom menus a quick overview but it's very very powerful